So I had been wanting Jake to propose for a long time, and I'm sure he would tell you that too. <laughs> it was kind of like, hey, whatever you want to do, you're more than welcome to. Um, and one day I was doing laundry, and he said, hey, Victoria, will you come here for a minute? I was like, oh, gosh. He has to have me come back there and find something again. And <laughs> I said, Jake, I'm really busy right now. I can't. And I said, I'm, you know, I'm doing laundry. Oh, please come back here, please. He just kept begging me. <laughs> and so I was like, oh, fine, you know, I'll come back there. So I walked back there and I walked around the corner and Jake was down on one knee and he was crying. And my first reaction was, what's wrong with you? And <laughs> he was like, I'm trying to propose to you <laughs> if you would let me. I was like, oh yes, of course. And then we went to his mom's afterwards and um, we kept laughing and then we showed her the ring and she was so happy and she looked at Jake and she said, finally, you asked her, so, but no, now we're here today. Um, January 6, 2011, I worked up the courage to reach out to the most beautiful woman I've ever laid eyes on. Little did I know that would turn out to be the biggest blessing in my life. Jake, I've never been sure of any decision in my life than becoming your wife today. You're by far the best thing God has blessed me with. I can't wait to spend the rest of my good and bad days with you, because with you by my side, I know that we can handle anything that life throws our way. Through all of the hard times, heartaches, and great times, you have stood by my side, and for that I will forever be grateful. You have continuously proven to me that your resiliency and work ethic is second to none. This makes me so excited for our future and our future family. I promise to love you unconditionally, even when you're being stubborn. Encourage you, trust you, laugh with you, and respect you for the rest of our days. I know without a doubt that you will always protect me and love me when I'm hard to handle, and we both know that happens often. We have always made a great team, and I look forward to turning this next chapter in our life. I'm sorry. We have been through it all, baby. There will be obstacles and mishaps, but not anything we haven't fought through or couldn't fight through. I have all of the certainty in the world that we were placed on this earth for each other. I love you so much, Jake. Oh, he did really good. Oh, that was so good. I couldn't ask for a better man to build a life with and a future family. I choose you today and every day to be my husband. Ten years later and here we are. We did it, baby. I love you. I'll see you at the altar, my future hubby. I'll be the one in white. Love your future wife, Victoria. You know, I, since I've been with Jake, I've never thought about, well, what if we weren't together? It's always been, well, when me and Jake are together 10 years from now. And that's another reason why I knew that he was the one. So, yeah, that's love to me. You, you look past the bad, and you know, in the bad you find the good. So that's what I've always tried to do with him. Sometimes it's hard, but you gotta do it if you wanna make it work. Uh, 
Uh, exactly what me and Victoria have. I mean, from day one, uh, I knew at the end. The way we are around each other and the way we treat each other, that, that's what love is to me. You know. He knows every single little thing about me. Same, you know, I know every single little thing about him, but he's just, he's so good about picking me back up when I'm down. He's my security blanket, that's what I always call him, because he works out of town a lot, and when he's gone, I just feel like I'm just not completely secure. I want him to be there, so I, that's how I've always referred to him as. He's my security blanket, so yep. I feel safe with him. But, yep. It's gonna be going through your mind when you see her coming out the aisle here. Told you to your back. Don't let him see it, but now, uh, I don't know. It'll be a surprise. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm ready for it. Yeah.